to my channel. I've got a bit of a different video for you today. Well, not different, but I just haven't uploaded like another video apart from my weight loss one in like about a week. I need to stop being so dramatic. It's not really that bad, is it? But today I have got for you guys a range haul. So pop to the range, reason being, because we are doing our house up, well, attempting to. It's a slow process, but we have changed our conservatory into a playroom for the girls just because I wanted my living room back. You know what it's like, kids take over with all their toys and everything. So we have officially changed our conservatory into a playroom for them, obviously more for Eva because Lily is only five months old. But, so we've moved everything into there for them. And I wanted to get some nice little homey things, some little knick-knacky bits, just to make it look really inviting for Eva to go in and play. And also when Lily gets older, and just to make it more homely, cosy, cute kind of vibes. Uh, that's what we're going for in there. The colour... <laughs> I have got Lilia with me in this video, by the way, because I tried to do a video when she was napping and my camera ran out of battery. So this is the second attempt. So I hope you guys appreciate my dedication. So yeah, we are changing the conservatory into a playroom for the girls with a colour scheme of pretty much, I want it bright, vibrant, inviting for the girls. And also we are planning on doing our living room up as well. Now we've got so much extra space. So, I went to drop Eva off at nursery and then on my way back, I popped into the range, picked up some goodies that I'm going to show you today because I thought it would make a nice video and who doesn't love a homeware haul? So first of all, I'm going to start with this cute little basket. It's a little pink velvet basket with grey handles and it was 3 99 I think, yeah 3 99 and I just thought this would be really cute for Eva's like lol dolls and little characters and things like that. Eva has got so much like little bits, um, obviously if you have a girl or a boy and they love lol dolls then you'll know the issues that I have <laughs> with all the little shoes and the little bits and just toys in general, just little bits and I just thought it was really really nice, I saw this not too expensive, quite big, and I just thought it would fit all her lol dolls and just little tiny bits and characters that get lost and lots of her happy land people can go in here. And I just thought it was a really good size, really good price, and it would look cute in that room. So I literally went around the shop twice for these and I was looking for a pom-pom garland to start with. And I also wanted to pick up some fairy lights for in the summer or just like when it when they're playing in there and it gets a bit dark because Eva doesn't really like the dark. And I just thought like a pom-pom garland and some fairy lights up would be cute. And then I found this, two birds with one stone. So it is a pom-pom garland string light with actual lights in it. And it was only £4.49 and it's got 30 LED lights. And I thought that would look so cute, like just round the top of the windows or I thought it could like swoop down by her kitchen area. So I picked this up. As I said, the colour scheme in there is like bright and vibrant, like pinks, whites, blues, that sort of thing, yellows. I don't really want a colour scheme in there as such because I want it to be really inviting and... It to go with everything so I don't really want to you know go for a Instagrammable colour scheme kind of thing so I picked these up next up I picked this up from the craft section and I literally thought it was so cute and it was only a pound and it's just this little um garland and it was just already like you could make your own or it was pre-made and I just thought this would look so cute like hung up we've got some hooks in there just hung up on the wall um, and obviously they did pink ones, white ones, but I wanted to get the one with different colours. So it's got purple, yellow, pink and blue flowers on it. And yeah, I just thought it was really good and cute and simple for a pound. And I thought that it would look really cute in there. So these next three items all go together. So I picked this up. I think it was like a pound or something. It's just like a little tub that you use for like plants and things like that but I thought that this could be used as a pencil pot 
um, just to go on Eva's little table. She's got one of the Ikea tables and I just thought we could put a pen pot on there and put some different pencils in and things like that. And that's what's coming up next, as you've probably guessed it, is these, um, they're geo, geometric, are they called or whatever. Um, some pencils I got her because I thought that these would look cute with some little rubbers on the end. And they were like a pound. This was like a pound. Um, so I thought they'd look quite cute in there. And then I also got her for a pound some colouring pencils. I mean, we've got loads of these, but like colours go missing and you know how it is. They break and things like that. I don't know how pigmented they're going to be or how good they're going to be. But I picked these up. Pound. Can't really go wrong. So, next up is a bit of a decision that I have to make. It's not really that bad, I'm just being drama queen. But I got this and it was, I think it was 1.99. It's a little book and it says ideas on it and I just loved it for the colours and things. And it's lined paper and then inside it's like got this spotty thing, pattern that's in at the moment. But I just thought it might be good for me to plan content in there. But then I know how much Eva loves like a good little like book like this. So I don't know whether to be kind and give it to her and put it on her little table and chairs for her or to keep it for myself. So I'm in two minds at the moment and it was only dead cheap. I think it was a pound or one ninety nine. Um, I just loved it. I loved the gold rose gold rings and just like the pastel colours on the front. So now we're moving on to living room bits just because I thought I'd grab some little living room bits while I was in there I didn't grab much so don't get too excited but I grabbed this massive candle because me and Sean are a sucker for candles he's more of a candle lover than I am but we just love like having a candle lit on an evening so romantic and I thought that this one was good it was a fiver and I got it in the blue because our living room is grey, blue and white. As you can probably see from the portrait behind me. Sean painted that, I didn't know. And it's massive and it's got three wicks and it just smells amazing. So it's True Aroma Seashells Scented Candle and it was £5. We're nearly there now guys, we're nearly there. Next up we have... Two picture frames, literally the same picture frame, size six times four, two pound thirty nine, and they're like this grey wooden effect with a white rim around the edge. And I just thought these would look nice in our living room. We are so bad because we have no pictures up in our living room. We have like one of me and Sean from when we first met, like seven years ago, and that's it. We did have like one of those picture things where it's got like loads of different pictures in it and then we did take it down to fill it with some of the girls because it was just full of me and Sean because we love ourselves vain <laughs> no I'm joking but we um and then we just never have got round to it and then now I don't like it because it looks really cheap but I thought I would grab these because they weren't that expensive and you know they just look I think they look quite nice and then when we change our living room around they'll fit really really nicely on the fireplace and yeah so I picked them up and last but not least it is not an item for the playroom it is not an item for the living room can you guess what it is it's for the kitchen <laughs> and it's this something so boring 3 99 and it's just a double oven glove in this grey and spotty colour just because Sean decided to put our old oven gloves on the hob when the hob was on and burnt them. So that was great. So I finally, literally about 10 months later, we've just been using tea towels and I just literally have the fear every time I use one because I'm more than likely to burn myself. We finally got some more oven gloves. So that's the last item that I picked up. So thank you guys for tuning in today to another video. I hope you enjoyed that haul. All that stuff was pretty much under five pounds and it all came to 31 pound altogether which I don't think is bad I got loads of stuff just not some cushions I really really wanted some cushions for the girls playroom just to make it a bit more cozy when we get the play mat which I've ordered which I'm just so excited to show you and show you the transformation and how good it looks but yeah, thank you for watching. If you like content like this, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe as I would love to have you here on my channel. I upload twice a week. 
once is weight loss wednesday because i'm currently on my weight loss journey after having my second baby girl who you can probably hear and have heard throughout the video and i upload my second video is either like a vlog or a haul or sit down chatty kind of videos motherhood pretty much everything my channel's so versatile but yeah please hit that subscribe button it would mean the world and i hope you all have a lovely week and i'll see you in the next one Bye guys.